Hello movie lovers, Bob for Bob's movie review here and today I'm bringing my unboxing and review of Tyrell on Blu-ray. Be sure to click subscribe and click on the bell icon to be notified whenever I upload great new content. If you enjoy the video, be sure to show it some love and give it a like rating. Jason Mitchell, Christopher Abbott, Michael Sarah, Caleb Landry Jones, Tyrell, when you're the only one. This year's answer to get out a devilish roller coaster ride. Here is a look at the spine. This one is for Magnolia Home Entertainment. Tyler joins his friend on a trip to the mountains for a weekend birthday party with several people he doesn't know. As soon as they get there, it's clear that he's the only black guest, or minority for that matter. And it's going to be a weekend of heavy drinking. Although Tyler is welcomed, he can't help but feel uneasy around a close-knit group of white guys. The combination of all the testosterone and alcohol starts to get out of hand, and the precarious situation starts to feel like a nightmare. Special features, interview with writer-director Sebastian Silva, theatrical trailer, radical satire and horror movie, all in one. Hey, there's Michael Sarah. I thought I was pretty surprised that Michael Sarah was in this. Um, so in the trailer, uh, this guy's like, "Oh, my name is Tyler," but they think it's Tyrell. <laughs> like, I guess that's the joke of the title. Uh, not rated. Region A locked. Runtime of 87 minutes. If you guys have seen this one, love to hear your thoughts without spoilers in the comment section below. Well, let's check out the inside. And here we have the disc. Uh, it just has the same art as the cover. All right, guys, I got to check out Tyrell. This one will be releasing March 12th, 2019. It is not rated. It has a one hour and 26 minute runtime. It's a comedy drama. It's directed by Sebastian Silva and it stars Christopher Abbott, Trust Arancio, Nicholas RZ, Max Born, Roddy Bottom, Reggie, Kathy, Michael, Sarah, Ann Dowd, and Philip Edinger. So this movie was about this guy, Tyler. Now they called it Tyrell, and in the trailer they showed that he introduced himself as Tyler, but the guy just kind of thinking, you know, he's African American, he said Tyrell, <laughs> you know, and it was kind of supposed to be like this racist kind of thought that the guy had but they don't really make a big deal of it in the movie so I was just kind of like I thought it was gonna be a bigger deal in the movie that he had mistaken his name for Tyrell instead of Tyler <laughs> so, so I'm not sure I guess it's kind of subtle that they would name it that when it wasn't that big of a deal in the movie so this guy is going with his friend to another friend's birthday and they're like out in the woods um, kind of just way out in the middle of nowhere at this guy's house and they're having a party and you know, throughout the, the weekend or whatever, more and more people keep showing up and uh, Tyler isn't very comfortable. Uh, it's pretty obvious right away that uh, he just doesn't feel like he fits in and he doesn't know these guys. And to, to some degree, I understand that they're trying to make this kind of statement that um, maybe, maybe these people don't know a lot of African-American people and he's not necessarily comfortable around all these Caucasians. Um, and I think that's kind of the point of the movie is just being uncomfortable around people of different uh, backgrounds. Now, to me, I'm uncomfortable around people I don't know no matter what. You know, if, if I'm in a whole group of people I don't know, like I just become really introverted and I keep to myself. And I don't think that necessarily has anything to do with, like, race. Although, you know, that's the point of this movie. I also think that, you know, it's normal to just kind of get shy and quiet and um, just maybe not be quite yourself when you're around 10 people you don't know. <laughs> and, uh, and so he ends up kind of drinking and doing drugs. I mean, they all are. And, and, and one day he gets kind of out of control and <laughs> takes things a little too far. To be honest, I was expecting more out of this movie. I thought something uh, was going to happen as a result of um, either just some sort of racial thing or as a result of him him drinking too much and doing drugs. 
something was going to happen, but I mean, <laughs> that's, that's literally it. It's just that this guy is super uncomfortable around these people, and that's all the movie is about. <laughs> Now, it was an okay movie, you know, I definitely liked the actors and the characters, and um, I enjoyed the story, but like I said, I just expected something more to happen, something <laughs> negative to happen as a result of this tension, and it just leaves you feeling like there should be more to this movie. Um, so I think for a score on this one, guys, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. It's a decent story, but definitely they should have done something a little more with it. Hope you guys did enjoy the review. If you did, be sure to leave a like rating. Remember, you can find more information, including affiliate links to purchase Tyrell down in the description below. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos. Check out the suggested videos. Check out my website, bobsmoonreview.com. And I'll see you guys next time.